that this aid needs to go to innocent civilians and not Hamas. We're going to be watching very carefully uh, how it's delivered. We're given the money. We know the money is fungible. And then we hand over the money. And then Biden State Department spokesman Matt Miller admits that uh, we don't know what the hell they're going to do with the money. I think the, the, the concern the Israeli government has, and they've said this publicly and they certainly said it privately to us, is that any assistance that goes in will be diverted once it's inside Gaza. That there is not a there's not an Israeli military force in Gaza, there's not a UN peacekeeping force in Gaza. The people with guns inside Gaza are Hamas. And so Hamas may try to divert this assistance and keep it from getting to the civilians who, who it is intended for. We think that's a legitimate concern. Uh, we've made clear that this aid needs to go to innocent civilians and not Hamas. We're going to be watching very carefully uh, how it's delivered um, because we want to be sensitive to those concerns, which we share. I, I, this, this the whole show, can we title this show, Dave doesn't know how to comment on the stupidity? Like, he's admitting it. The Israelis are like, oh, Hamas is running the show. You're giving them 100 million. They have all the guns. We have no ability to manage what's going on down there. And what do you mean? So. What do you mean we're gonna make sure the money gets to the people who need it? Like, what does that mean? Like the average guys and okay, here's 20 bucks, good luck. Like, what are we even talking about? We are literally paying Hamas and they're, they're full on admitting it.